How to Create and Sell NFTs on Tezos, a Guide for Beginners As NFTs and metaverses are becoming more and more popular, we've decided to explore this topic for newbies and answer the hottest question of recent months. How can you create your first NFT? We will use Tezos as the basis for our guide, as it is one of the cheapest and most convenient blockchains for non-fungible tokens. Moreover, NFT communities, famous artists, large marketplaces, rankings, and other important components raise the Tezos ecosystem to its current level. The simplest way to create NFTs is to use dedicated marketplaces to store, use, or trade such tokens. Any marketplace required to connect wallet to use it. So at first, you need to get a Tezos wallet. We recommend using Temple Wallet, whose download link you will find in the description. You must also make sure to have some Tez in your account balance. For an NFT mint, one to two Tez or three to six dollars is enough. You can buy it on any crypto exchange and withdraw it to your Temple wallet address. Let's start with the oldest NFT marketplace on Tezos, Hick at Nunk. Go to hickatnunk.art and click the Sync button in the upper right corner to connect Temple wallet to the website. Then follow the in-app instructions to proceed with the connection. Now, Temple Wallet is connected to the marketplace, and you can click the Objects Mint NFTs button on the hamburger drop down menu to add a new token to the blockchain. After that, you will need to fill in all the required fields, such as title, description, tags, additions, and royalties. Additions refers to the number of tokens you want to create, and royalties is the percentage of each trade of your token which will be credited to your account. Please note, you will not be able to change this data after you have signed the Mint transaction. Click Upload Object and select the file you want to issue on the blockchain. Pay attention to the supported formats. You can check an exhaustive list of formats on the screen. In our case, we have chosen an MP4 video to create an NFT. After the file is uploaded, you need to click on the Preview button, and if everything is correct, you can mint the NFT. You'll find the Mint Object button down below on Preview page. You can also check the total operation cost below the button. Confirm your transaction on Temple Wallet to complete the NFT creation process. You're done! Congratulations on creating your first NFT on Tezos! If you want to sell your tokens to other users, click on Manage Assets on the Marketplace menu and select the newly created NFT under the Creations tab. On the token page, open the Swap tab and specify the number of tokens that you want to add to the marketplace, as well as their value in TES. Pay attention to the additional commission indicated by the marketplace. To get your NFTs to show up on the default feed on Hick at Nunk, you either have to set up a profile or hold some HDAO. To edit your profile, select the Edit Profile option from the menu and add your profile picture, username, and profile description. Now, let's talk about the largest marketplace on the Tezos blockchain called Object.com. To get started, click Sync in the upper right corner of the interface and connect Temple Wallet. First of all, we must note that all NFTs created on other Tezos marketplaces purchased and sent to your address, will be available for viewing and interaction on Object.com. In addition, this platform can also be used to create new non-fungible tokens. Then, you can go to the Create section. Note that Object.com will offer you the ability to create collections where you can add new NFT tokens. By creating a collection, you add a new contract to the chain that can be updated in the future. Before you can create your own token, you will need to create your first collection. Upload your collection logo, then add its name and description. Click Create and confirm the transaction. Then go to the tab for adding a new token and then fill in all the fields by selecting a collection or creating a new one. Also, do not forget to indicate the license under which you distribute the content. You must then select the number of tokens you want to issue, set the royalty on the sale, and click the Mint button.
You can also launch an auction. To do this, open the NFT token page. Select the Auction tab and fill in the data required to start trading. You can find the auction rules in the object.com platform documentation. There, you can also set the price of the token and wait for interest from potential buyers. Of course, creating an NFT is not limited only to marketplaces. We've described more complex but variable methods in a special article, the link to which you will find in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. We look forward to your questions, reactions, and topics for the next video. Subscribe to our channel to learn more about Tezos.